say third time's the charm. I think I might have gotten it fixed. I didn't realize changing to a different phone would cause the different settings when I record live on Facebook. So I'm trying to check on my laptop if I am sideways, upside down. But hold on, it's starting to look. I am right side up and the way I like to be so you can see the most. So now I just am a little crooked. Let me try to adjust just a little. And if you're here, if you could go ahead and comment. I have my comments on now so that I can tell that people are on to watch. Let me move my scissors and stuff. I have a little bit of a mess. I've been making lots of cards this week. I'm Debbie Broughton, your stamp, Stampin' Up! demonstrator from St. Robert, Missouri. And I'm so glad that you could join me. I know I'm a little bit late due to my camera, but I'm here now. So if you're here, if you could just comment, that would be great. I'm going to show you today the suite that is in the mini catalog called Splendid Day. Stampin' Up! started a new thing this summer, is we could order a suite of product and they would have like a class online for us to watch how to make some samples. So I decided to try that out. And so that's what I'm going to show you is the samples that I got to make while taking that class. So first of all, let me show you what's in this set. Here's the stamp set. It's called Splendid Thoughts. It says sending hugs, much love in your new life, Let's celebrate, and then there's some eucalyptus leaves, and then some just leaves, and a bee, and down here it says, today is a day to remember. I'm going to shut my blinds. It looks a little blurry, too. I should have played with this more, I guess, with my phone. I don't know why it looks kind of blurry, but... We'll just kind of go with it. And I will try to play with it later. Okay, so you get that. And then the dies for the set are called uh, Splendid Stems. And this die goes with this, the eucalyptus leaves. And... This die goes with this one. And then we have the die that will cut out the bee. And then these are just some extra leaves and foliage that you can uh, cut out with the stand, uh, emboss and cut machine. I almost forgot what it was called. I remember when it used to be called the Big Shot, but that's not what it is anymore. It's the Stampin' Up! and Boss and Cut Machine. So, these are the dies. So far, nobody has said that they're here, because I'm wondering if it's as blurry on your sets, on your laptops or iPhones or computers as it is on mine. It looks very clear when I look at the phone, so I'm just not sure. All right, another thing that comes in the suite is some uh, ribbon. The So Soft Seafoam ribbon. Actually, it's seam binding ribbon. And it's just a very pretty color that would go with a lot of different items. And it has a little bit of a shine to it. And then there is the DSP. Which now I've used some of it to make the project. So I don't have full sheet of some of them. This one, I'm 
it took two sheets to make the gift bag, and this is what I had left over. But this is one. It's like a copper color with uh, Calypso Coral on the other side. And then this is Fresh Freesia foil. And on this side, just the color, no foil. This is silver. And on this side is the so so soft sea foam. And this one it has a little bee here. This one makes some great background paper. This one again looks like copper. And the back of it is calypso coral. It's very pretty. Either side, but I love the foil side. This is foil in the so soft sea foam and the back is like little eucalyptus leaves and this one is silver this is our last one silver with a smoky slate on the back so this might be considered like smoky slate but it's a, a silver foil and again smoky slate on the back so that is the paper. Then one more thing that comes in the suite. Let me find it. It is these little leaf trinkets. I really don't know why it looks so blurry. It's supposed to, the iPhone 13 is supposed to have a great camera. Okay, these are just like little trinkets and you can use some linen thread I will show you what, how I made this tag for the bag, for the gift bag, using some linen thread to hold this onto the tag. They're very cute. Just add a little bit of bling and color to your projects. So let's get started with, I'm going to open up the dies so I can point out which dies I used, because that's always nice to know. So here's the first card. It has a so soft, that name is so hard, so soft sea foam in the background. It has some of the fresh freesia paper here. And then this, I used the water painter brushes and brushed on some pool party and fresh freesia. I stamped these words, much love in your new life together. And I used this die right here to cut out these uh, seafoam leaves and a little bit of the ribbon in the background. So that's my first card. Oh, I want to keep that open. Here is the next card. On this one, I they use the uh, brick 3D embossing folder. And then this is on petal pink. And I cut out the eucalyptus leaves. I stamped them and then cut them out with this one. Stamped out these other leaves with this one. And then I stamped, I used this one and this one and this one just to put in some filling leaves in the back of the white and then I use this one as a label just to put the greeting I popped the greeting up I fussy cut it the greeting and popped it up on this half circle here and then I added some pearls the demonstrator who was showing us how to make this card had little pearls but I didn't have any little pearls so I used the larger size so next we have this one. This one I used this stamp and stamped all on the petal pink in the background. And then I cut out four of these in the different color of foils. The green ribbon, some sea foam paint, uh, cardstock in the words. And it just makes a little 
nice let's celebrate card just to kind of show off the different foil papers and then here is number four so I used see how I cut these out I used or they used the negative that's left over after you cut these out and they kind of made like these little windows with this die cutting out some leaves and this one says today is a day to remember in this last window on basic white cardstock and in the background here we stamped uh, these solid leaves here with Versamark and then put some wine embossing powder on there if you can kind of see that through the windows so that's card number four these are just like quick cards and if you wanted to put them all together as a gift you could make this bag this is using two pieces of the DSP and then on this tag I used the gold leaf embellishment the half circle for the words and then a circle die to make the whole thing and this I stuck a hole there and used some linen thread to tie that and then I used that to tie it to the seafoam ribbon and it's just like a little gift bag that you can put your four cards and four envelopes in and give as a nice gift so that was just kind of quick review of the Splendid Day Suite. I hope that you enjoyed it and to know that July and August are both celebration months. So for every $50, you can pick a free item out of the celebration catalog. Or if you spend a hundred, there's a net, another level of things that you can pick out from the catalog or you can get two $50 ones. The only thing that's sold out so far, because everything is while supplies last, is the pool party and seafoam note cards. They were really popular and they went really fast, so they are now gone. But there's a lot of other cute things in that catalog. And stay tuned this week, I'll be showing some more using the celebration set so you can feel get a feel of those so that you can get them before time runs out. Well, I hope you have a great day and thank you for joining me and sorry about all the starts and finish and finishes that didn't even work, but now I know how I can do it with my phone. Have a great day. Bye.